We have my new creation, Perry Terry, where he has a little spider cousin, which I named him Jimbo Jr. In relation to the other Jimbo spider, which you don't get to see. Just like Perry Terry spider, but he's a good little spider. He's yellow, he has green eyes, blue pupils, orange stripes. Purple shoes, bright and pink Aragra, a color, black stripe, sonnet, yeah, in his mouth, and got like little, little fingers, like baby fingers. All five of them. You can tell in the background I did the tree, did the background all green. Let me turn on the light so you can see better. Here's the dirt and all that. Ah, much better. You can actually see him better now. I don't usually do spiders. That's why they're creepy and freaky. But this one is the youngest out of the other ones. Plus, I'm kind of running out of ideas. Always doing the Tumbly Clink ink series. Well, not always, but every year. And come up with some new ideas, but it's always spiders. At least he's one of the good guys. Got a big round cranium on his head. Since he's very young and helpful and most likely friendly. Also he kind of looks similar to almost like player from Game Tunes. Except this one got like six eyes. So it comes to show that all spires are are mean and cruel. This one is a good guy, a spider. He just usually eats meat, but not most likely other bugs. So yes, Perry Terry has a cousin, which makes him like an uncle. Of all spiders. He's playful and wants to have fun. How about the other characters? Because it comes to show that, well, you know the rest. He's kind hearted, he's gentle, he's the most friendly of spiders you'll ever meet. So that makes him like. Almost the second, most likely the second good guy spider in the Tumbly Clink series. And a good spider. Would be playful and helpful to others instead of eating them. I think yellow suits him pretty well. Looks like he's a colorful one. Oh yeah, those pink things that are next to his mouth. So his white shite teeth. And he doesn't have like bushy eyebrows like his uncle. And I think that's all I can say about him for like maybe almost five minutes into the video. Didn't even take too long to cover everything in, so I use those big huge jumbo crayons and color pencils and everything else to just make this character design so perfect. The world presentable. Mmm, yeah, that's it. See you all next time, everyone. Thank you all for watching.